What's going on guys, Chris Mosley here. Um, just really a quick, um, I guess you can call it a tip or just some inspiration or just uh, words of advice for other photographers and videographers and creatives out there. No matter what it is you do, um, don't let people discourage you and take the creativeness and the fun and the happiness out of your profession, man, because I'm a videographer full time. I'm a photographer full time, man. And uh, sometimes you'll run into those clients that, that, that you really can't make happy. Like it's really nothing you can do to please those people. Um, I don't really know why they book or why you cross paths with those type of people. Sometimes I used to look at it like um, tough clients are supposed to keep you on your toes. Um, dealing with tough clients made my editing game strong. Like. Now, rarely I ever have a client that'll send me something and say, hey, can you change this? Can you change that? It's always A1 because uh, dealing with those type of clients have made me shoot in a way that's like sort of to protect myself. Like when I'm at a wedding or a baby shower or a, a, a birthday, I make sure I get the most important moments because I've, I've shot events and people will say, hey, you didn't get us. Uh, singing happy birthday or you didn't get us cutting the cake or you didn't get uh, the kiss at the wedding so missing those type of moments will make you realize hey I got to stay on my p's and q's like this is my job like I got to make sure I capture the moment but don't let those type of people that are kind of tough on you ruin your happiness when it comes to this profession because this is what I do for a living and I enjoy doing it but um, sometimes you'll come across those clients that will suck all of that out of it for you. Like they'll turn it right back into a desk job. They'll turn it right back into the reason why you stopped working for somebody and started working for yourself. So you really got to sit down and dig deep and say, hey, I'm not going to let you do that. Um, there's been cases where it's been situations where things were out of my control where I wasn't really able to capture something. You know, some, someone may step in front of you, it might start raining. Um, the situations of the lighting might control dra change drastically where you basically are unable to get the shot. You know what I'm saying? And, and it's sometimes when it's like, hey, um, you can have your money back because I'm a, I'm a big believer in energy and protecting my energy and protecting my space. So. If it's a situation where somebody is giving you bad energy, don't take the booking. You know, all money ain't good money. And I do this for a living. This is how I pay my bills. But it's sometimes when I still might say, hey, I'm good. I don't want to deal with you. I can already tell by your energy that you, you're not somebody that I want to deal with. So just something I wanted to share, man, because it's a lot of bad energy out there. It's a lot of bad energy energy out there. Protect your energy. People don't understand how important energy is. Protect your time and your energy. There's two things you ain't going to be able to get back, man. I really believe in protecting my energy. It's people that I cut ties with and I, I don't let them book me. Like, I don't want to be around, with you, around you. I don't want to fool with you because I'm protecting my energy. I'm not letting no negative energy get around me, man. So, that's my advice for you today. Take it or leave it. Hey, but Either way it go, man, you're going to have to deal with bad clients. That's just the way it is. But knowing how to deal with them, knowing how to get them out of your face and uh, how to please them at times is, is going to be very important. So just be prepared for it. Know how to deal with it. Like I said, sometimes it's just a situation where it's like, hey, you can have your money back. I'm not finna fool with you. I'm not about to let you mess up my energy. So here's your money back. And I'm good at what I do. It's not a situation where it's like, I don't know what I'm doing. It's just you deal with some t difficult clients sometimes, some tough clients that it's no way to please them. You're not gonna please them. I don't care how good you are at what you do, you won't please them because they are negative nasties, because they have bad energy and you don't want that around you. So protect your energy. That's my advice for the day. Protect your energy.